the kids just are supposed to be home on the bus. And my friend, whose son is on another bus, was just coming home, but she saw that our daughter's school bus has a pop tire and is kind of parked halfway up in our neighborhood. It's gonna be a long time before that bus gets fixed. So they said if we go get our driver's licenses and prove our identity, we can go and pick them up from down here. But we all have to go individually because we all have to prove that we're the correct parent. This would actually be a whole lot easier if their regular bus driver was with them today because she knows every single one of us parent. Anyway, let's go see if I can find our kid. Here's all the parents trying to get their kids. And they told us like um, all like all like tire tire pops or something. Yeah, your tire popped. Which one did it pop? Do you know? We don't know. We were just like we didn't even know. Yeah. I'm kind of confused because I've looked around the bus and I can't find out which it's tire is blown. I just want to give you an idea of how chaotic this is. There's cars lined up behind me, a couple up ahead of me, cars turning around, all the way down here, all the way down the street to go and get all of their kids from the bus. Ashley, are we good? Yeah. And she didn't even have Chelsea on the bus today because she's going to running club. No. So now we have to go in like a half hour to get Chelsea from running club. Right? It's like crazy girls day. What? Girls on the run. Girls on the run is what it's called, huh? Yeah. Okay, let's go home. Dude, the first thing the kids do when they, they get home from school is they notice they've gone to Costco. Every one of them has come in here and grabbed a sleeve of Ritz crackers, didn't you? The first thing you went for, they're inside. All right, go get your backpack. Let's go inside. All right, the girls have a trick. Show them me real quick. You gotta go. Good job. Good job, boo. Are you coming with me? Yes. Okay, hurry, get your shoes. Let's go. Hi, boo. I sit in the front. No, you cannot sit in the front. Hi. Put your bag down and get in. How you doing? Good. Ashley has something fun to tell you that happened on the bus today. What? The tire pops. Tire popped on her bus. <laughs> Oh. You have to go down the bottom of the, or middle of the hill and go and oh, get her. Oh, great. Crazy, huh? <laughs> hey, okay. Ashley, sit down, buckle bus. up. We gotta go. I'm lucky I wasn't on my bus. I know. Okay, so we got Chelsea, and she's gonna tell us about girls. What is it called? Girls on the Run. Girls on the Run. We have a special chant, I guess. Oh, you do? Yeah. Okay, so tell me what you did for your Girls on the Run. So, the field over here, um, we would run as many times as we could, and we would have to right as we get back to our group leader um we would tell them something that's kind that we can do to somebody else and then um like we would and then we would um get a bracelet and every time we went around and got the bracelet or or did something nice um we would get a bracelet and then um for this week it was a star like how can we That's awesome. So you had fun? Yeah. All right. All right. So I jetted out from work a little bit here. I've got to run some errands and one of which is getting oatmeal. So you want to know how we feed our kids and get them ready in the morning and things like that. We find, I think Dana calls it like stock up price. That's the time you go and you get the item in, in a lot. And right now Costco's got oatmeal on sale at the business center for like four bucks off or something like that. So I'm gonna go stock up and help Dana out with some shopping and then I'll get back to work. And maybe Dana can explain why and how we do stuff like this, but it's a big help. We gotta feed four little kids, so they're growing fast. That is a sale price right there. All right, so I got the oatmeal here. We got a total of five because I think that lasts about four months. Then I got some other things for work like uh, plates and register tape as well. So we'll view my cart here, all that. That's how we try to save money and keep the kids fed. So one of our little tricks works pretty good, tastes pretty good. Anyways, Dana's probably doing something else today, but I'll get these things home to her. Have a good one. Last night kind of took a turn for the worse <laughs> let's just put it that way Ashley right after dinner time we were kind of rushed for dinner 
So I don't know if it was that or just she just had a long day or she's still trying to adjust from the time change. I don't know what the deal was. But she had a complete meltdown. Lasted about an hour and a half at bedtime. Led to me needing to keep Chelsea outside of the bedroom down here with me. Um, and then Jason came home and he helped deal with her. And then she ended up in our bedroom at like one in the morning and she has growing pains. So that might've been the start of what she was anxious about. I don't know. So I didn't do any more with the video. I didn't end it. Jason did go to Costco for me and get me some oatmeal on his way home from work, which I really, really appreciate. I went to Costco and the other day and tried to get the same oatmeal, but the, cause I saw it in our email for you know the Costco instant savings or whatever when it says like 350 off or 450 off a box when it goes on sale like that and it does two or three times a year that's my stock up price we go through a lot of oatmeal it's a better option than regular cereals so I do stock up on it so I'm not sure how many Jason got um, he already put them away in the in the garage so I'm not sure exactly how many got but I told him to get stock up you know amounts and so it should last us a good couple months and then hopefully there'll be another sale and we can buy it again. Anyway, I'm babbling. I appreciate you guys watching today. I didn't plan on filming yesterday. It just kind of suddenly came up that that bus had a situation. Anyway, that situation is all taken care of. The kids are at school today, but that's for another video. All right, you guys, take care. Bye-bye.